Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a Google Pixel 3a or 3a XL and basically you have a display issue. Maybe you have the black screen of death where your phone is completely black, but you know it's still on. You can hear it or feel it vibrate or you can hear it ring or maybe you see some LED lights flashing or perhaps you're stuck in a boot loop or maybe you're frozen or maybe the Google Pixel 3a is just unresponsive. I'm going to show you several methods to get your phone back up and running and this will help more than 50% of you guys, not all of you, okay? Anyways, the first thing to do right now is grab your phone and what you're gonna do is force a restart, okay? Simply press and hold the power button, press and hold and continue to hold until you see the Google logo, okay? So let's do this together, okay, ready? Here's the power button right here. One, two, three, I'm gonna press and hold. Pretend I have a black screen, okay? So I don't know what's going on. I'm still holding on to the power button and I'm not gonna let go until I see a Google logo appear. I'm still holding on. I'm not gonna let go. I'm still holding on. Okay, now I can go ahead and let go of the power button and because of the uh, Google logo here. And now your phone should be up and running, okay? Especially for, the, for you guys that had a uh, frozen screen or unresponsive or anything like that. Now, if you guys had a black screen issue and it's still not working, then the next thing I want you to do is this. Go ahead and grab a paper towel. Well, first thing is if you have a case on here, take it off. Also, it may help if you have a screen protector on here, you may want to go ahead and pry that off, okay? Now, what you can do, instead of taking the screen prote protector off now, because you pretty much ruin it, is try every step in this video. If, if your phone still has a black screen, then go ahead and take the screen protector off and go through every step again, okay? Anyways, go ahead and grab your phone here, and what I want you to do is clean your sensors on top, okay? So, no, fo no phone case, no screen protector on here. Let me... Just get a paper towel here, and let me just clean the top sensors here. Just like this. Now, I want to, and now what I want to do is, again, a force restart, okay? So, power button, press and hold the, down the power button. Do not let go of the power button until we see that Google logo. So, wait a little bit. I'm still holding on to the power button, waiting for that Google logo to appear. Okay, I'm still holding on to the power button. Okay, now I can go let go, and hopefully you are out of the black screen. Now, if you're not, the next thing to do is this, okay? Go ahead and grab a paper towel, and what I want you to do is I want you to press everywhere on the top of the screen as well as in the back. So go ahead and just like grab your thumb here. You don't actually need a paper towel, but if you want to use a paper towel, just put it on there. And what you want to do is you want to give it some pressure, okay? Also note that I'm not responsible if something happens to your phone, okay? So do, the, do all this at your own risk. So... Go ahead and give it some pressure, all even around the camera lens as well, okay? So my thumb is pressing on there. I'm also pushing on the back at the same time. And just keep doing this, pressing all over. Also on the back of the phone, go ahead and press all over the back of the phone, even near the, uh, the fingerprint scanner here as well, around all the lens, all in the corners. And now do this, okay? The, the power button here, I want you to press it in and out very quickly, okay? Because it could be jammed or stuck. Press it in and out like that. And do the same thing with the volume rockers up and down as well, okay? Just keep playing with that. Up, down. Let's just pretend that the screen is totally black. I don't see nothing on the screen. Power button or the uh, volume rockers up and down. Power button again, in and out, in and out, in and out. Now, do the same thing again. Press and hold the power button. And don't let go until we see the Google logo appear. I'm still holding on to the power button. Again, let's pretend that this phone is totally black. I'm still holding on to the power button. I'm still holding on. Okay, now we can go ahead and let go and hopefully you are out of the black screen. Now, if you're still not out of a black screen, and of course, you, you know, most of you guys are gonna have your phone back up and running, but it's possible that you may have an issue with your motherboard or you may actually have a um, display screen issue too, okay? Anyways, so if it's still not up and running, next thing I want you to do is this, okay? Because it's possible you have a loose connection somewhere in the phone. So go ahead and hit your phone onto the back of your palm like this. Turn it over on the screen side and do the same thing. Turn it back over. Give it a few whacks. 
And now press and hold the power button and do a force restart again. Press and hold the power button until you see a Google logo appear. Now, if you still have a black screen, another thing that you can do, and this, and this worked for many other Android phones, believe it or not, is what you wanna do is go ahead and put your Pixel 3a, put it into a Ziploc bag, and then put your phone into the freezer, okay? Just put it, Ziploc bag, put it in the freezer and wait one hour. After one hour, come back, take your phone out of the freezer, take it out of the Ziploc bag, and then you wanna do the same thing. You wanna go ahead and do a force restart. Press and hold that power button and wait until you see a Google logo appear and then let go. If it's still not working, then do the same thing we did towards the, uh, the beginning of the video, okay? Press the power button in and out. Press the uh, volume rockers in and out. Also, you wanna put pressure all on top of the screen, also on the back of the screen. Give it a couple of whacks, backside and front side, and then press and hold that power button and wait for that Google logo to appear. And hopefully your uh, Pixel 3a is back up and running. Now, if it's not, you can always try to do a factory reset, which that helps sometimes. The only thing is with a factory reset, you're gonna lose all of your data. So hopefully you have uh, some kind of backup or maybe you don't need it, or maybe there's nothing important that you actually need on the phone. So in order to do a factory reset, we're gonna to have to do this, okay? We're gonna to to press and hold two buttons um, simultaneously, simultaneously. Press and hold and do not let go. And it doesn't matter if your phone's off or on, okay? So anyways, I mean, my phone is on here, but again, let's just pretend I have a black screen here. Power button, volume down. Press and hold both buttons at the same time and keep holding, okay? So power, volume down. Ready? One, two, three. I'm gonna press and hold and wait for this menu to pop up. Power button, volume down is still holding. I'm not gonna let go. Wait for this menu to pop up, just wait. It's gonna come. I'm still holding on to both the buttons here. Okay, now let go really quickly, and now we get to here, okay? Basically, this is the uh, fast boot mode. Right now, it's in start, okay? What we have to do is go into the recovery. So with the volume rocker down, you wanna go down, 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 to recovery mode right here, okay? So recovery mode, now to select it, we wanna press the power button once, okay? So press the power button once. It should reboot and then we should get a no command uh, Android guy on here. Okay, so from here, the next thing we wanna do is you wanna press and hold the power button, okay? So hold down the power button and then just press the volume button up once, okay? And then let go, okay? So here's the um, power button. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold, press and hold it down and volume up once. Boom, I'm gonna let go, okay? And now we are in the Android recovery here. And if I use the volume down rocker here, we can go down to where it says, white data slash factory reset. Again, guys, remember, a factory reset, you're gonna erase everything on your phone. It's gonna be as if you bought, just bought your phone brand new, took it out of the box, and you have to go through the setup with your language and set up your Wi-Fi and everything. Anyways, if you wanna proceed, and hopefully you guys have a backup, okay? So if you want to proceed, what you do is you press the power button here. So press the power button, and then you get this message here, okay? And in red, it says, wipe all user data. This cannot be undone. So once you guys go ahead and click on volume down to yes, and then you select it with the power button, you cannot go back, okay? So basically what's gonna happen, I'm not gonna um, factory reset my phone, but basically what's gonna happen is as soon as I touch this uh, power button, um, to say yes to proceed with the uh, factory reset. It's going to go ahead and start formatting everything on my on my uh, my Google Pixel here. You'll see everything here, wiping cache partition, wiping everything down. And then it's going to reboot. And this may take three minutes. Sometimes it takes like 10 minutes, depending on how much clutter and data you have on there. Anyways, once it goes um, through the whole entire boot process of uh, resetting everything, you're gonna get back to the welcome screen, you know, and then you gotta set up, um, you know, what language you want. And hopefully that gets you out of the black screen as well, okay? Anyways, guys, if any of these steps work for you, let me know which step or what combination uh, you think actually worked for you. And that's uh, pretty much it. Guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.